Lining up now, race 92, our women's under 17 quad. This is our final. All boats from the heats made their way into this final in lane one, Redwood Scullers. Lane two, Marina AC. Lane three, Los Gatos. Lane four, Long Beach Juniors. Lane five, Maritime. Lane six, Channel Islands. All six of these boats came from the heats. We used that initial heat to help get sorting on lane assignments here in the final. Redwood Scholars in that lane one. Setting themselves up early here, along with Marina AC side by side, pushing themselves out early off of the start. We'll be catching up with them after our delay here. We get a replay of those starts that help us see how the starts went, and then we catch up with them midway through the race as the boats have sorted themselves out through the middle of their piece. Yeah, and this is one of those finals that progressed from heat. So again, we should see um, some really close racing here side by side between lanes, definitely seating the fastest crew out in lane one. Um, and then from there, uh, moving moving through uh, based on times um, and placement from the heat. So right now, early leader is going to be Redwood Scholars coming out of lane one. We saw that uh, the top quad, the youth quad, take the gold uh, or take the trophy home in that previous race. Um, and now Redwood Scholars leading this race just slightly over Marina Aquatic Center. Marina Aquatic Center just slightly over Los Gatos. Back to them, it's going to be in fourth place, Long Beach Juniors, and then over to Channel Islands for fifth, and then Maritime in sixth. Okay, really tightening tightening up in the in the racing up front between Redwood Marina and Los Gatos Marina and and Redwood pretty much dead even for that top spot Los Gatos just a little bit uh, behind Marina and Redwood for that third place position and then we move all the way over uh, to Ch lane six Channel Islands putting on a nice push here and we'll uh, find out exactly where we are on the course in real time and come back with an update. As Adrian said that, we're getting a nice clean over, overhead shot here. It looks like Redwood Scholars in one, Marina AC in two, Los Gatos in three, with a bit of an even line looking like between Long Beach Junior and Channel Islands. I might give that to Long Beach Juniors, though, with Maritime sitting in that sixth position currently out in lane five. But up front, it is Redwood Scholars now taking that lead right now, about three to four seats, actually about three seats over Marina Aquatic Center. Marina now being paced by Los Gatos. The Marina and Los Gatos even back to Los Gatos by uh, one length. It is going to be Lo uh, Long Beach Juniors in the fourth place position. So still some overlap actually between all boats. There's not a whole lot of open water between them. So we still have contact with both places four, five, and six. Channel Islands doing a nice job trying to kind of take a little bit of that lead away that Long Beach Juniors has. Maritime continuing in six, but still in contact. Redwood Scholars looking like they are holding good control of this race right now. And it looked like we might have a challenge happening from Long Beach Juniors on Los Gatos on the last shot that I saw. As we get to the side profile here, we can take a look at the actual technique of what's happening in these boats. How these women are flowing through the stroke gives us a really good insight into how the boats are moving. And I believe what we're seeing here, that's Redwood Scholars in that far shot. But as we pan through all these pro crews rowing through our shot. Yeah, and, and I think the biggest uh, competition right now is going to be between Marina and Los Gatos for that second or third place position. So we're going to keep our eye on them, and they are pushing each other so much that they've come to take a little bit of that lead away from Redwood Scholars. Keep your eye on lane three, Los Gatos, because that is the boat right now that is on the move. Yeah. 
Yeah, big push there by Los Gatos. Almost looks as if Los Gatos might have actually taken that lead away from Redwood Scholars. Redwood's still in the second place position just by about a seat over Marina. So we're going to keep our eyes on those top three boats. In fourth, it continues to be Long Beach. Long Beach now with a bit of open water. Maritime having overtaken Channel Islands for the fifth place spot. So Maritime pushing themselves into fifth. Channel Island fading just a bit back into that sixth place position. But now, as we're seeing that profile perspective, as soon as the camera angles change, it gives us a totally different perspective here. We do still have Redwood Scholars in that first place position. Marina AC in second, Los Gatos in third. I think Los Gatos is going to try and come up and challenge Marina AC for that second place position as they move into the final bit of this race. They're definitely starting to chop back a couple inches at a time, not saying that they're walking through Marina, but they're definitely trying to offer a challenge to them. Yeah, we saw those wicked sprints from previous races. So we'll see what these guys have in the tank as they come through final 500 meters, 250 meters. Those positions holding steady right now. This is where the race gets tough because you know that Redwood Scholars, they're holding on to that lead position. But between Marina AC and Los Gatos, you know that they are thinking back and forth. Hey, who's going to make a move and when? What are we going to do? And how are we going to challenge each other? And this is where the burn starts to set in. You know that that finish line is in sight. And yet this one to two minutes of time can be the longest one to two minutes of your life knowing that you are fighting tooth and nail for positioning as you close out this race. All right. And against the shoreline, Redwood Scholars continuing to hold on to that top spot. Marina still in contact and overlapped with Redwood Scholars. Redwood uh, doing a nice job still holding on to that lead. But Marina taking a look at the big challenge here right now in these final strokes from Los Gatos. So almost dead even between Marina and Los Gatos as we come all the way to the line. Coming down to the beach, take a look at this under-17 quad. Redwood, can they hold on to that top spot? Marina and Los Gatos pushing each other all the way to the line. Yeah, Los Gatos is not going to let this go. They want to put the screws to Marina AC and see if Marina AC is going to respond. Or if they have the ability to drive through, take that second spot from them. Both boats coming into the finish right now. Redwood Scullers starting to lose a little bit of space to Marina AC, who's coming on. Redwood Scullers looking like they're going to hold on to it. Los Gatos just a hair back from Marina AC. And it looks like we've got Redwood Scullers, Marina AC, Los Gatos, one, two, three, in position there. Following them, it looks like in our lane orders, we've got Long Beach Juniors, Maritime, and Channel Islands making their way down towards the finish. Thank <laughs> you. 